Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Super Family Friendly YouTube Content Creator there. Totally not doing any spicy titles or thumbnails anymore. Um, and welcome back to Hearts 4, using the No Step Back DLC. And which right now, we're doing a little bit of getting smarter here. And which apparently, we, we're going to talk about our institute. As the foremost engineering school, the St. Petersburg Polytechnical Institute has long provided our school or country with uh, <laughs> engineers and industrial designers. We should expand it further and ensure that we will always have the best people available to fill any new positions in our growing industries. Wow, that sounds great. Uh, as much as I want to do that one, probably Adaptable Army, because we're already in Africa, and Africa is everyone's favorite playground, especially when you play certain mods like TNL. But this war is stretching across several climate zones and may have many varied uh, terrains. We must be able to find every terrain, no matter the weather, we want to win this war. And by God, do we want to win this war, as we are really behind on infantry command, but really behind on, uh, huh, ship arenas. No, level 3 is not bad. Really want until 94. Ah, we're going to rush 1944 subs. Those are actually very, very high, high quality things. Usually, as long as we can make them have enough naval XP as well. In which, well, as you can see, we sent the horses to Africa. And I'm not, I'm trying to make a joke, but I can't think of anything right now. Oh, also, I guess I did send some planes over here too. Ooh, better writers, nice. Oh, uh, we lose a couple planes here and there. So in this episode, my goal, our goal actually, is for us to destroy the Great Britain-ish people. Yeah, we're still trying to build some roads here. Let's get at least one more thing of uh, military factors going, just because. We go and produce. In this episode, we're, we're getting some carry bombers, carry fighters, good stuff, but we're going to get a lot more fighters. We're going to get um, quite more tactical bombers, a lot more naval bombers, and we're going to need a thing or 6,000 things more of rubber. So, uh, there you go. Right there. Engineers, not bad. Let's see. We're going to focus heavily on naval stuff in this episode as well. Carriers, battleships, all that good stuff. Uh, I did say infantry equipment was pretty lacking, so there we go. Uh, oh, horse boys. You done. I love them horses. Horse kids. Horsey kids. Hmm. Uh, horse, horse it up. Oh, yeah, uh, Vichy France is done in the war with them. Um, honestly, that's, that's too many divisions for that group. National South Africa do be looking pretty nice. Holy crap. DF Malin. Oh, look at them. That looks awesome. Oh, wait. Did they give them... South Africa has enough men to give guarantee support to Germany. Well, I guess they're always beating other people up for more stuff like that. Oh, and I guess we're going to go to war with Bulgarians. Because, you know what? For today... We don't like them, uh, Bulgarians of the socialist kind here. Go on in when you can. They wanted it. They deserve it. And we'll go to war next with... Oh, man. Because we can, so yeah. Main goal, take out Yemen. No, uh, Great Britain. Yeah. What are the losses like so far? We've lost about 700,000. They've lost 1.8 million. Uh, Axis has definitely lost more, which does suck, but... We capitulated way more people. Portugal needs to go. Oh, Bulgaria's lost about 120,000. Not bad, too. Of course, we did get rid of 2.08 million Commonwealth of whatever lovers. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh, they capitulated. I wanted to kill them all off. Oh, we won. Um. Oh, look, Vyaka. Well, uh, I'm all about reducing lag, so. As much as I wanted a puppet, you know, F word puppet state, fascist puppet state. The best we can do is, uh, that. Maybe France. And I want to go to war with Turkey, but they have a non-aggression pact with the British, which is fine, whatever. But a non-aggression pact with the Germans, which I don't like. I want to go to war with them. I really want to go to war with them. We'll go to war with probably Burma, Bangladesh, all them folks as well. Keep working on better anti-air as well, because that'll help our ships. Um, I'm going to let the Japanese and others take care of this part. I don't really get involved there, so. Oh, it's definitely a battlefield here in the ocean. Oh, boy. Oh boy. If anything, here, send you guys just like spread across. And they'll take the uh, enemies out eventually. Ooh, we lost a yeah, couple things here and there, huh? Two more destroyers, nice. Destroyers. So, yeah. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We got quite a few comments to go through as well, which will be very, 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 very good. Blow the Suez Canal. Eh, we're kind of okay. We don't need to support China on this one. Fuel would be nice. Do we need more aluminum? We're okay for now. Really, the big thing is rubber. Rubber is an issue. Just like Yemen. Pretty good. Goodbye, Yemen. Ah, uh, love me the horses. Alright, let's go in. Let's have a good time. Ah, Rojevsky. Nothing like Rojevsky the man. And there they go, doing other stuff too. Have a, have a good old fun time. And then you guys do this as well. And Oman's been called in. Alright, goodbye, Oman. And I'll, time to go to Asia. 
Well, I guess technically we already are in Asia, but whatever. Back to Asia, everybody. Cancel the lend lease. That's nice. I wonder when Vichy France is going to get annexed. Or we annex them or something like that. Let's see. How are we doing over here? Ooh, better infantry equipment. It's not bad either. Of course, we need to get better guns. Happy 1943 already, everybody. I'll be able to get here. So we have one civvy, which is fine. Two refineries. Three more millies. Yeah, we're going to focus pretty hard on getting more rubber. So we'll do that, do that. We'll focus more on that soon. Military organization. Our attempts to build a large mechanized army were noble, but more than we could afford to win this war. We'll have to focus on the arms that have carried Russian armies of victory for centuries of infantry and artillery. It also necessarily requires to disrupt the existing formations to a degree. Now, as one of you guys did say in your comments, intervention in the Americas focus can make American nations join the Axis, which does make it easier for us to invade. So, as much as we want to do into inter Central Asia, we've already taken out Afghanistan and Iran, the last, and the last break southward. Looks like fun too, but... Actually, we go get war against free fans. We're already pretty much war with everybody except for Turkey, but... Intervention in the Americas. The many small nations in the Caribbean and the Latin America have long been played by unstable governments. It's time we flex our big, fat political muscles and encourage their domestic political evolution into the direction of strength and stability. Once we develop like-minded governments to our own, they will be offered a place in our growing military alliance. Oh, they lose 2% stability and daily fascist support goes up by for two years. Nice. Countries that being influenced are more likely to become fascist. They become fascist as a result of this influence will be invited to a faction. One, two, three, four are invited to the join the Axis. Sounds like good. So that will... Sounds like good. Sounds good. In which we will do that one next. Oh, we can't get any more yet. Darn it, socks. Anything else here? Just in case. Gets a little bit more aluminum for now. I think it'll be good. War bonds. search a war support. But we, we need it right now. Yeah. Definitely, definitely, definitely. What is this? Oh, military organization. We are... Our organization. Organization regain. Oh, army XP gain. Really bad. This national spirit will be removed upon completion of the focus national military reorganization, which I want to get rid of as fast as possible, so that's fine. Light tanks still suck here. Uh, we got plenty of other stuff, though. Yes, cruiser hulls, good. Did someone in... Hello, they already invaded! Whoa, would you look at that? The Spanish! You invaded every tile but a port! Now you have a port! Ooh, that's actually not bad, guys. Not bad. How are we doing over here? Are we actually winning? Um, hold on. We gotta take a double check and see what's going on here with the, uh, good old, uh, British, British peoples. No, it's have plenty of ships. Okay. Well, the goal is to get rid of all their ships as much as possible. I mean, guess if we did invade them and take them out while they still had all the navy, I mean, it'd be better to pop at them, but, you know. Oh, well. Okay, well, it's like Ireland's gonna be definitely being contested, so. Better already as well. That'd be very, very nice. Uh, better light cruisers are very good, light cruisers, especially since one, actually a few of you guys did ask us to invade America, so, well, we'll see what happens. Um, we'll try to make that in the next episode, and just try to jump over, so that would probably be an important thing to do. Uh, I do want to make more roads, though. So we'll do that one, and then more rubber, too. 100%, there you go. 1940s carrier, it is 43 already, just go get 44 carrier. Might as well. Oh, wait, what? Who's called in? No, not, not the tricks, though. Eh, whatever. Who cares? Another horse, and we're done with the horses for now. Oh, good job, guys. Yeah, that's enough horse, horse boys for us. Alright. Anything else there? Nope. Lost a plane. Nope. Nope. Early destroyer. Anything here? Legit. Oh, you want to become a logistics wizard. Oh, that's not bad. I kind of like... Oh, I do want you as a... You're very experienced. I like that a lot. Hmm. Hmm. Iraq is fully deciphered. Well, that's great. Can we? Get more ciphers done, yes. But, into war bombers, naval bombers, maybe, if possible. That'd be really nice if we could have more of them. Ah, very good. Very, very good. And maybe we could boost ideology in other nations. And maybe restore the old Eastern Empire. Oh! There was once a time when a glorious empire stretched from across the rim of the Pacific, pushing deep into the Americas. They all considered decisions since then traded these possessions for long or short-term monetary gains. But under our leadership, Russia may once more reclaim its American possessions. Or simply retake their current owners' withdrawal from them. We built a far eastern ports. Oh, that's not bad either. Especially since we want to make a lot more factories and stuff. Yeah. Weekly war goes up too. Well, that's not bad. Yeah, we should probably do this one. If we're going to secure our uh, far eastern interests, it's much less go on the offensive. We must drastically expand our shipbuilding and repair capacity in this region. Oh, look at that. Any more tanks? Yeah, yes, please. Um, go with this one. Yeah, we are so far behind on military tech, it's not even funny. 
They do that. They got plenty of attack bombers too. Nice. Are the Japanese invading or just transporting soldiers? I hope they're just I hope they're transporting soldiers, but I don't want them to die in the water. Alright, any more ciphers done? DC, baby? Nope, we gotta do DC. Not bad. You two are done too, huh? Oh, I forgot about... Hmm. There we go. Might make it easier for us. Uh, Turkey, since we can't even invade you, which I do not like that we cannot, but whatever. From Scotland. We got about Bangladesh. Bangladesh, Bangladesh, Bangladesh. 30 day focus, not bad. Let's go up here and do this. Ooh, naval mission efficiency. That's exactly what we wanted. Infiltration. Oh, a little better land that attack. Thank you very, very much. You guys, let's go set you up for naval bases, anyways. Three divisions go right to Dova. Let's go to the top. One, two, three. Let's see if this works. One, three, and we'll go Uno Dos, which actually was probably not smart to do two right there, but whatever, two right there. Which I, this is what I usually do now, but we'll see if it actually works or not. Two and then two. And get the tanks down here too, which aren't gray, which oh, I know we're trying to work on tanks as well. Let's see what happens. Blow Suez, now we're good. We are okay with that. Uh fuel why not. Get at least one going for now. Rubber! Not enough. One, two, three. More roads though. And more dockyards eventually, but once we actually get some good ships to use. Oh, now we need more aluminum. No, no, no. Darn it, we need more aluminum too. Actually, we're only limited exports. We can't go to close economy, that sucks. Oh, ship stuff, yeah. Hmm. I mean, we're not really going to be refitting anything. So you get 10% more ship repair speed and better costs. So that's not bad. Accident chance goes down. You heard Dex us for cures, which I don't like. And less heavy attack, no thank you. I don't want less sub detection or anything. If anything, I only want positives. So Vestipol, Marine Flint, thank you very much for investing in us. Yeah, we'll do this one. Definitely do this one next. Uh, what is this here? Just keep thinking as much as, much as you possibly can. We're well, not really thinking much, but whatever. Destroyers, destroyers. Lost a couple planes here and there. We're still doing okay on planes. Just naval bombers, which is not good. Oh, we're losing quite a few naval bombers now. It's not good. Not good. Well, we don't have enough space. Here, help build up here, here, because I don't trust our allies. Allies kind of dumb dumbs. But they did well with taking out almost all of Ireland. The Americans are there too, which sucks, but whatever. Get some better of that too. Let's keep at least two to three on uh, ship stuff at all times. Actually, I have a third one here too. Third carrier. Actually, you guys need. Uh, that's not good. One, two. There you go. And there you go. There you go. Now it's looking a lot better. Secondary batteries. Might as well get the next one, too. And an adventure in America is good. And rebuild the Fire fleet. Well, we're technically literally building it in there, too. So, cruiser holes. Nice. Oh, we're going to grab the 44, but we got to grab some of this, too. All right. Air Doctrine. Thank you very much. You can bomb visibility. Venezuela joins the Axis. Venezuela and Peru have both accepted our lines offer and have sent forth joined the action. Are they in a form of in Americas? Nice. Very, very nice. So do we have any decisions we can take to influence more fascist uh, supporters there? Or is it just going to be... What happened down here? Oh, we already have these guys. The Commonwealth of Nations with America, while Brazil, I guess, joined the Axis. I forgot about that. Hey, uh, Getulio Vargas. The Dutch. Why are the Dutch so... Dark brown now. It looks a little, slightly different than before, but whatever. Um, with Venezuela here. That's nice. Well, wait, they say they joined the faction. Did they really? El Salvador did. Well, it says they did. Um, is that bugged? Whispers of a revolution. Throughout Russia and occupied Ru uh, Poland, there are whispers of a revolution brewing in the underground. Plastered on city walls with the words niche. Something obor, and similar slogans calling for the resistance to fight against the Russian occupation until now. Uh, resistance activities have been limited to the distribution of propaganda, Produ disruption of production lines, and occasional bombing of sabotage, but now the resistance lays oddly quiet and the atmosphere in Poland is thick with ice cream? No, treachery to mistrust. Russian agents across Poland predict a full scale rebellion sponsored by the Polish government in exile. Only by clamping down resistance can the Russian Empire hope to keep Poland in Poland. Let's run these traitors. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, you could try to do the Warsaw Uprising. I'm not sure how, war how successful it would be for you, but we're at 30%. I mean, it's going up slightly more. But then again, 
We don't own it, so... G g good luck with that. G g good luck. Also, I do want to go to War Turkey because our fleet's trapped. Which... Can we get naval access? That's for docking rights. Can we get military access? Okay, so maybe we can move out here now. Actually, who's justifying on who? Oh no, the Great British are justifying on us! Whatever will we do? Can you actually leave and just like go home? Okay, they can't, thank god. Oof. I guess all that. I want you all to come over here too. Rushing meddling in the Americas? What? Never. Never. Unfortunately, that their involvement has become into the open. Lies. Lies. Uh, what are you guys doing as a focus right now? Airborne divisions, you're doing what over here? Reclaim the jewel and the crown. Oh, who cares? Not bad. Okay, so now we have slightly more rubber. Um, Vichy France? Why not? Sounds good to us. That's pretty good. Boom, boom. Yeah, I think we'll do a boom, boom. And invading the Amazonas. So be it. Better artillery. You're going to keep one line on here all the time. Usually, but let's get some more construction speed. And then, dual purpose secondary batteries. Not bad. Get that one. Get the heavy stuff as well. That would be good. And more air doctrine. Yes, please. Can you guys actually go? No, we don't have native supremacy yet. Good luck. I hope you make it. And you actually need planes too. So, uh, one, two. Good. Good. There we go. Now that that fleet is a little better. We still have really god awful battleships, but you know, oh man, they're so slow. Oh my god, they're so bad. They're just so bad. Oh, I forgot about Yemen. How did I forget about Yemen? Oh, Yemen, 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 Yemen. My bad, I forgot about them. Members of 1905. Uh, well, we can do that. Let's do modernized Far Eastern fleet first. No, I'll do Westward Bound. Much of our Western possessions were lost with the collapse of our empire caused by the revolution. The time's coming to build up our infrastructure in preparation for climbing rifle possessions. Yes, please. Another research slot. There you go. Medium batteries. Yes, please. More dockyards. anti forward cruisers hold. Not good enough yet. No, no, no. Uh, these carriers are okay as well. Let's keep making them for now. Re oh, railway guns, absolutely. And better artillery, arty guns. Thank you. You know what? Just make the convoys. We'll get there. We'll get there. I promise. I promise. Did you get all ships? Nice. Head on over here, because you're gonna get the heck bombed out of you. That's the spirit. Ace by promoted. Very nice. And tank stuff. Uh, that's not bad. More liability. Killed off. Armor. We want to do. I do want to go heavy tanks. So heavy tank designer. Why not? Just so far behind in research and stuff. That's all. Could you kill them all off and protect our shippies here? Could you do that, shippies? Oh, we still have island there too. Oh, now I'm going to go to Yemen. Don't forget the Yemenis. And is there anyone else we can really beat the crap out of besides Bangladesh? Um, I don't know. I'm gonna come back to Russia and hang out. But Bangladesh is next. There you go. Well, I guess we're off. See what happens. Um, one, two, three, four. Cool. Let's see what we can do. I don't have high hopes for this, but we'll see what happens. Never mind. We just landed. In a port. Completely unopposed. Alright then. I'll take it. Wow. Wow. Well, there's a fleet. <laughs> I 
the fall of London. Onwards, comrades. But who here calls ourselves a comrades? Hmm. Not bad. Very good. Other comments included. Uh, two transport planes for supplies. I always forget that. You guys re always recommend that. I always just forget that. I thought that was UK or, or Great Britain already. So, yeah. Uh, we will eventually. Yeah. I gotta remember just, just gotta remember to use them. And we're done with their doctrine. Forward defense. Nice. Well, what have we lost? Cruiser holes. They've lost 10. Oh, we lost 19 planes, but they lost 10 destroyers. Nothing really there. Nothing really there. Lost a couple planes. Convoy. Oh, look at that. Nice. We found the carrier. We found a battleship and six destroyers. Pretty darn nice. What the heck? Are, where are your divisions? Nice. That's nice now. Yeah, up to 39. Is that it? After them, they capitulate. Oh, that's so nice. That was going to be so nice. Um, clubs. Actually, how many ships do you still have? Ooh, would it would be worth puppeting them. Yes, absolutely, but I'm not going to. 200 ships not enough. 205 ships not enough. Yeah, I want a real Russian Navy. None of this... Great British Navy, no thanks. Look at this game in Portugal, too. Why is it so easy now to invade the UK, like, or Great Britain? Like, some people might have said that already, but, like, why? Poland? What happened to Poland? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Oh no, 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 no. Alright, so you get all of free France. Um. Maybe except for this part here. Yeah, maybe except for that part. There you go. Uh, you know, I, I kind of want to take this part. Uh, we'll see what happens. So Italy, Italy, where's Italy? They get stuff too. They do get the reward of getting some stuff too. Um, Free France is not in the war, so you know what? Italy, you can take this stuff. Um, you got that too. And we'll give you this area down here. Yeah, that seems probably. We'll take everything else up there. That's fine. Uh, Italy, where are you still? You're not done yet. You get all Greece. And Yugoslavia. You get that one. They also get... No. Russian Empire, no. Where is it? Oh. I was looking for uh, Greece, but People's Republic of Hellas. We'll take Afghanistan. We'll take Nepal. We'll take Iran. Shang-Chi. Uh, we'll go to the Japanese. Jeez, are they at the top? No. Japan, Thomas China, there you go, Oman, yes please, uh, not you guys, Yemen, oh, the very worthwhile states, Spain can get have these guys, Sin Ki uh, actually, we'll probably take Sin Kiong, if, if anything, we'll take Iraq, very worthwhile lands, I would say, Latvia, rightful Russian territory, Estonia, try to stamp out communism there as well, yes, Bhutan, British Malaya, we deserve that one, do we? Eh, not really. I don't think we really deserve that one. Here, Japan, you can have all the rubber in the world. We'll take Tibet, we'll take Xinjiang. China, China. Japan can have China, China. Kingdom of Portugal. Um, take the Azores. And why not? Pakistan, Lithuania. Now, the rest of the UK down here. South Africa can get this up too. Uh, wow, France looking. Or India's looking pretty bad. Empire Brazil, Integralist Brazil. Don't want to deal with anybody else. There you go, thank you. We have no way to protect our stuff in the Americas yet, but that's fine. Well, at least we got one enemy done. Someone else says that Switzerland joins factions more often and it gets to attack more. So yeah, yeah, uh, that so that kind of does happen. Restoration development or peace? Not really. In other words, are we going to turn to developing our industries and peace and improve our life over people? Yeah, it's not over yet, man. It's not over yet. Relax. Molotov, river drop pack, experts and camouflage, even more entrenchment. Submerge. Yeah, we must make it clear to every single citizen that spies, enemy agents are present everywhere, and that any idle talk can give the enemy a crucial piece of information that gives them an advantage. I mean, yeah, pretty much. East Bengal. Oh, yes, please. EPSHs. Nice. I did say I want to do some heavy tanks eventually, so let's grab some of that. Oh, look at that rubber we got. Nice. 
very good. Actually, very, 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 very good. Yeah, I know we could have released him as a poppet, but I'm taking the other ships up like that. But whatever, I don't care. Um. Oh. We're no longer allied. Are we not at war? No, we're not. We're still allowed on their lands. We're still allied. Improved in, oh, now they can do improved national speed. That's actually kind of cool. I don't think I've ever seen the AI do that, but yeah. Plus we're bound, yeah. More daily, one, plus one political power and more ideology drift defense. Alright. So be it. So be it. We'll come back down there in a little bit too. Smash? Yes. And then, actually, Tank of Grad. Well, that's not bad. Artillery breakthrough, superior war machines. Uh, expand the Imperial Fleet. The Imperial Fleet is pathetically weak compared to the navies of other major powers. We must make its expansion our national priority. Yes, please. Uh, let's see. This Leventry, Selenia. Nur Inyat Khan. Well, let's get Yevgenia Barakina. Barakina. Whatever you pronounce your name as. Let's see what we can do about this. Oh! The Nova Zealandia. Uh, Republic declared war in New Zealand. Oh crap. Another civil war. Getting invaded in the Amazonas. Well, what else is new? Alright. Oh, we suck a carrier. Look at that. Nice. Alright, so with that one done, now we can come over here and have a good old time doing stuff like this. The Merry Plane. You guys are probably all going to die, but that's okay with us. Yeah, come over here. See what you can do. Find some convoys, raid the crap out of them, and get ready to go to war with Iceland once we're done with Bangladesh, if I remember to ever invade them. You guys are next, too. It's only ten days, it's fine. It's fine. Come on in, everybody. It's a party. Advanced engines, nice. Honestly, I don't know if you can get the tanks by this point. Oh, hello. Yeah, we definitely want to get those subs done. Subbies and chubbies. Oh, carry health, that's right. Um, hangar space. Deck armor. I thought there was a mod that actually increased the amount of armor you can throw on your carriers as well. There might have been. I can't remember. Uh, four, there you go. Oh, come on, man. Come on. We're so close to glory. So close. It's fine. We're not here for carriers doing a ton of damage, so. Bye. One still there. Good, good, good. Two, three. Goodbye. Just in case. We don't need this many, but whatever. Bangladesh is gone. Very nice. Wait, what? Are we at war with the Turks now? Wait, what? No. I thought for some reason we were at war with the Turks. Okay. Ooh. Convoy sunk. Convoy sunk. We did lose an early sub hole, which is fine. Whatever. Uh, you guys are fine. You guys are fine. You guys are fine. Ish. Bur -ba 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 Burma? Oh god, Japan did annex everything, did they? Yeah. Yeah, that's not looking great. In Imperial Quantum Territories, we'll see what happens. Free India? Free India? Actually, since we're here, Siam's next, I guess, too. 30 days ain't too bad, though. Keep learning, Karapet Aliyev. Actually, if anything, I don't want you guys down there. I want you all. Around Iceland. That's better. That's better. Nice. Keep singing those American convoys. And now we can upgrade you. There we go. That's better. Well, you know what? Screw it. You're not even close to getting done, so I'd rather just make good ones. Screw it. Two, three, four. Boom, 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 boom. There you go. It's fine. Whatever. You didn't see anything. A lot of ships. A lot of ships. Construction 5. Construction would be nice, but we got these guys going. We gotta get some of this going as well. But better cruiser hole first. Love me some cruisers. Anything else that I need to be replaced? No good. 
Brahma's looking pretty nice. Do we have another one? No, we don't. Okay. Um, planes. Let's see, you guys. We'll just go right there or something. It's fine. What's going on here? Infantry uh, specialist, ambusher. Eh, yeah, we'll do that one. Oh, you're down here. So, okay, that's not bad. Uh, realistically, I want Vichy France with us. La Buria. 85 days is quite a few days. Um, come down here, Spanish Empire time. You guys are up there, just kind of hanging out, having a good old time, which is fine. Whatever. Uh, Spanish Empire took all of Ireland, which is weird, but whatever. Uh, cruiser hole, grab some armor next. I'm not going to make cruisers without enough armor. And you will be doing what? I think this has gone by. Whoops, I just let it just kind of sit there. Well, something like is really lagging, I forget. Um, reinforced Western Naval Bases. The Baltic Fleet is very exposed in the bases. Or we should invest some resources in protecting its anchorages and improves repair capacities. Nice. Sapphires for them is done. Good. Keep sinking, keep sinking. We're waiting for him to get an upgrade. He's level 4, though. He's definitely learning. He's level 4. Go horse boys, go! Y'all could be smart and just encircle them. There you go, nice. Not bad. Iceland? My oh, we lost six subs. That's actually really bad. That's really bad. Do we lose it? No, we still have ten. Hmm. Still learning, which is pretty good. Austin uh, Rejevic, we should probably do this when we have divisions ready to go against them, but whatever. How good are you naval invading? Um, not bueno. How about you? Minus 50% attack. Quite bueno. Let's come up here and just do that. You should be able to invade them, fine. But we'll see. Modern engines, cool. Get some more armor as well. Another di division. Cool. Expand the Imperial Fleet. And then develop the Western bases. Yes. Who's over here? Newer. Yes. Welcome, Newer. Welcome, welcome. Another early sub sunk. Sunkerinos. That sucks. But oh well. I'll also try to get more. Um... Oh wow. You guys are all damaged, huh? Uh, what? Scap of Flow, huh? Supply throughput. Ranger Fleet provides repair services for it, pretty much. Uh, yeah, yeah, max it out. Max it out. That's good. Turkey. Wait. Wait. It is not. Wait. What? 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 Uh, why are you allied with the Turks? Wait, what? Why did they leave the faction? Gov Covenant of the Mediterranean? What? Huh? What? You better not abandon us, too, Germany. Actually, I was worse all looking. Or Zazwa. So it's slightly worse, which is not good. But that's okay. And then more heavy ship armor would be nice, so we might as well get that one. What's up here? Ah, better subbies. Subbies and chubbies. Kind of like it actually this way. Taking out uh, the UK first and then just, or you know, Great Britain, whatever. But then just destroying the. Everyone else independently. It's kind of nice. Lots of subs. I want sub daddies. Um, just deploy back over here. Actually, no, don't. Who are you? Uh, Chernomorsky Baldvoldini Flot. I speak fluent Russian. Totally. That one. What's another one? Russian Empire Task Force 4. I cannot pronounce that one. There you go. Fine with us. Yes, brother love. Get another one for subs too. Can we make even more naval bases after this one? Nice. As you see, Wolf yet? Yes, he is. I'm glad I looked. Oh, that's not bad. Um, any penny says less. Visibility would be very good. I'll go to Lancer. I usually go to Lancer for more penetration. Reveal chance is okay, but I like the penetration. 
and to put a cooldown. And if they can't see us as well, that's also very, 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 very good. But, all right, let's come over here. Because I'm going to rush through these, all four of these, and get as much as this as possible. Reinforce northern naval bases. Despite being located north of the Arctic Circle, Vermont is ironically only part of the remains ice tree of the entire year. And it's access to open seas. We should develop it further to allow better access to the rest of the world. Followed up with... Uh, what else? Oh my god, stop going over there, please. Ah, reinforcement, so they need bases. The Black Sea might look like a secondary theater, but if we lose control over it, we'll open up our entire southern territories up to the Vietnam invasion. That's happened in the Crimean War. We must not let this happen again. Should strengthen naval bases in the region. Pretty much, man, pretty much. Ooh, destroyers. That's not good. Our ally destroyers, not good to lose. Another carrier. Stacking penalty? Yes, there is. But oh well. Did I actually tell you not to go? Oh, how stupid of me. Well, we just fun sign. I won't take that long, anyways. Level eight, not bad. Burma's gone finally. Heavy ship, might as well. Nice job, guys. Actually, if you want to, there's not enough really space for this. Good job, guys. Good job. More of this too. Good. Light ships, uh, gives more defense for an invasion, support stuff like that. But, oh, that was an honor too, nice. Uh, should just be able to do that. There you go. <clears throat> Southern naval bases, please. Yes, please. Followed up with, uh, all or nothing armor scheme, but, like, and wait, while we read. Reinforce Eastern naval bases. Even after the humiliation in 1905, the Japanese have not stopped making noise about encroaching on our territories. We must be ready for war against them, then that means strengthening our naval bases in the region. Pretty much. It's actually really nice when we're doing it like this, like I said. Just so nice. Oh! 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 What the heck? Turkey! Turkey! Papa! Papa G! Papa Hamadi Hamadi What? They all, all of a sudden just go to war with us. Ooh, that's not good. Whatever. Um, that is so not cool. So not cool. Here, you guys come over here. You guys, come down here. Is Vichy France with us? Yeah, they are. That's good, at least. Wait, why do they go to war with us, though? Destroy the nation's pride. That was that is something I was not expecting. But the Germans were ready for it, so at least they're ready for it. I'm not. Oh my God, that's that's a huge border. What the garbage, man? Italy, after we gave you everything. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's why you don't trust the Turks or Italians. Basically the same thing. You any upgrades here? Anti well, I don't understand how you can be a sub guy and be an anti sub. Well, I guess that makes sense. You know exactly what you have to do to kill them all off. Naval maneuver is not bad. Commentating, though. Nice. I love the magnetic dangers. Even less computer reveal chance is super strong. I love it. Oh, it's only going to help us out, too. Ooh, no, I don't I don't do that. I want you to go over here this way. Like this. There you go. Yeah, as soon as you get there, just kill them off. Please, just kill them off. They do not deserve life. I, this has got to be buggy. I thought Venezuela was going to join us. Honduras? Actually, yeah, why didn't... I kill them off, too, because he can. Just because he can. That's such a bummer. They join the Covenant in the... Okay, whatever. Call all of our allies in, maybe? If we can. No, we can't. Oh, boy. Oh, it's us. Yes, 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 please. Nice, it's like a heavy, heavy cruiser. Yeah. Now you want to come in? Yeah, whatever. As long as we can push somewhere on the front. Obviously, we're not doing great everywhere, but still. I feel like they're doing force defense, but they're not. Nice. Now, we'll come back up here and expand shipbuilding ports. Our geography ports also have widely spread out shipyards in support of our, our to support our various fleets. Any type of increasing in shipbuilding capacity, therefore, is spread out as well. 
So we've got one building dock, or one building slot in dockyard. One, two, three. Eleven more dockyards. Not bad. Alright, so no, they're not winning because the horses don't have enough support here. Fighters, we want some attack bombers. There we go. I'll do that, do that, do that, do that, do that. That's fine, whatever. Give them all to the horses. Might be a bit too much. Could maybe have gone extreme, a little extreme there, but whatever. I have to expand ship building plants. God dang it, okay, keep expanding here if they really want us to do. Rifle heir of the Empire. I mean, you might as well at this point. The old enemy? Oh, yeah, for weir years. 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 Sweden was a thorn in the Empire's side. They've gained again attacked Russia and tried to create a coalition against us. Tsar Pia I began pushing them back and beating them at Poltava. In, in 1809, we again defeated them, and no one thinks that made them know their place. And one would think that they didn't know their place, but they've kept trying to contest our interests and relations in the Baltic region. It's time to once again for. For all squashes, tiny nation. Are we out of stuff? Really, really? Wait, we have another sub. Here, go three. It's fine. What are we out of? Tanks? Besides tanks, anything else? Okay. Let's see. Do that as well. Make sure we have a supply basis here too, because there's, there's a lot of divisions here. Yeah, that'd be nice. It's not bad. You guys are still struggling down here too, but we're doing we're doing okay. Not great, but okay. Especially when we come down to this side, maybe. If you have absolute air superiority, just bombing them. Well, we got 50. Okay, that's not enough. Whatever. And make sure we got enough planes here too. Definitely wasn't expecting this. This backstab. Philippines. Philippines are almost gone. Canada is a major power, huh? Dutch East Indies. Turkey. Not enough dead yet. Not enough dead. I want every single one of these guys dead. There you go. Nice. There you go. Mm, naval bombers, strap bombers. We even have some casts too, look at that. Fighters. Now, look, I hate this so much. I hate this system. It's not very efficient. Just say we can't get any more planes. It's so annoying doing it like this. I don't want Mark 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, or 7. Oh my goodness. It's so annoying. I get why this exists and has to exist, but like it's so annoying doing this. Wow, we need a lot more attack bombers then. Scout planes, no thanks. They have no use, very little use. Once we do this, going to you know, go to war with them. Italy, Italy, you made a grave mistake allying with the Turks. That makes no sense. But I guess you're trying to make a what was that one faction? The triumvirate? Yeah. How'd that work out for you? Let's want to do that with this one too. Flag. Oh. oh, yeah. I want you guys to go across too. Let's see what happens. Um... Turkey, you failed so hard. So disappointing. They have no trucks too. Oh, do you have any uh, railway cars? Oh, yeah. Gee, it's over, it's over, here. It'll be over here. No? Oh, darn. Not yet, at least. Not yet. Maybe someday. We put a lot of roads up, man. A lot, a lot of roads. As long as we get naval superiority over here, it's really all that matters. Good working conditions? Why not? There you go. There you go. Alright, so let's make sure we are okay here. That would be very good. And after expanding shipbuilding plants, barrier troops? Yeah, we could. 
Uh, Modern is a Farsi fleet. Probably. Yeah. Tsushima does, so we cannot rely on weight of, of numbers to truly carry the day in a naval engagement. We might require well trained crews and flawless modern warships for them to sail. A new fleet we construct must be able to contend with that of our technologically advanced adversaries in the Pacific and Atlantic. And Atlantic. Don't forget the Atlantic. Actually, the shippies. So we have nine. Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, Asian capture. That's not good. After that one. Um, Cooper. Oh, collaboration government would be so good to do. Seducer? Yeah. Can Phil be double agent? Okay, I'm not bad. It looks like we've definitely done some real damage down there. Uh, we have more influence down there as well, so. Then again. Oh, we need way more aluminum now. Holy crap. Get rid of that. Thank you. Mediums. We could make heavy cruisers, but now nah. We need more better we need better screens. Our control, level four, level four. At the very minimum level four stuff. Um, level five, level four. Aircraft. Anti sub stuff is not great yet. Oh my god, we can't even do anti sub stuff yet. We'll be there in just a little bit though, so. And we're done with our land auction. Great. Get rid of this stuff then. Should be there very soon, honestly. Cool. Alright, up next. Let's see. Better anti stuff like that. Very nice. Oh, it was down there too. I forgot about that. Oh crap, I did forget about this, didn't I? Yeah, I'm sure. Do that. Be more offensive. There's nothing really care about. Be more offensive. Give more attack. Anything here? Uh, there you go, that one too. And you know, just a wizard. Dang it. That's alright, whatever. I'm surprised Jeremy's not really pushing that much. It looks like we've been doing a lot of heavy lifting. Maybe? Maybe not? Whatever. We'll get there. We'll get through it. Oh, we get that. You guys were there. Oh, we're fighting through there. That's fine. Oh, we fight. Oh, we lost. Oh, we actually lost a division, huh? That sucks. Japan, what have you been up to? You had, you have all, all this stuff. You should also really. Ooh, yeah. Actually, I have them. That sucks. Um, we'll see what happens. I guess. We get the port down here, which is pretty nice too. Build everything up here. Nice. There you go. Build all that stuff too. Go in, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. As long as America. Wait. War plan green. Yeah, please go to war with them. They don't have that many divisions. A lot of manpower. Almost no. We almost caught every combo they've had. Holy crap. That's nice. Nothing there yet. Italy, please die. Oh, we were backstabbed, my friends. Absolutely backstabbed. And heartbroken. Not really, but whatever. It is quite the tragedy that way. If we can take that, it'll be over for them. That's nice. Force it. Landing craft's good. Got that one too. Do that as well. More millies? Nice. Um, there you go. Get some more from you guys. That'd be fine. We need pretty much everything that you got. And there go the Turks. Good job, Turks. Good job. Good. You guys are still struggling, which is fine. We're going to win in the end. In the end, anyway, so it's fine. I'm pretty sure we will. As long as we can land in Canada and move quickly and fast enough, that's all that matters. So I want you guys 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Here. Are we going to invade Newfoundland or was it was Labrador? Newfoundland? Something like that? We'll throw in Harbour Shore, why not? Sounds like a really good idea, actually. There you go. And not there yet. Three. Where's three? Anything for three? Why does it cost so much? Because we're not getting that much more naval XP. That's why. If that's the case, 
Uh, plain stuff, we're done with you. Combined arms, that's not bad too. Daily arm XP gain. Hmm. Combo rating is not bad too. Uh, infantry attacking defense. Airborne assault. Eh, nothing really here for or naval stuff though. Hmm. Kind of sad. Monitors that fires the fleet. Well, we might as well do the old enemy next and then the rifle air to the Empire. Well, the old Byzantine Empire is long gone, so we still need to protect the pilgrim pilgrims of the Holy Land. It's good the British and French are not <clears throat> up to the test, so it should definitely fall to us. Pretty much. Pretty much. Oh, and you guys this too. Three, two, one. Can you go in? Please let him go in. Because once we get a good enough foothold, we'll be fine. Wow, we cannot win here, can we? Of course, then again, we're not really attacking here too much. We've really pushed really far down into these guys, haven't we? If you do that, that's fine with me. I don't really care. There you go. Infantry. Never mind. Alright then. Yeah, I guess Vichy France, if he wants this stuff, that's fine. Well, we gave it to them, thinking that they'd be our ally forever, but, you know, I guess I was wrong. You can have the body of Africa, too, I suppose. The Horn of Africa. Um, it... Yeah, where's Germany? Germany didn't do much with them, huh? Are they really in the war? Germany. You know what? I can't find them, so. Yeah, I'll take these guys too. Thank you. Not bad. Ah, way more aluminum. Thank God. Oh, so much better. So much nicer. Anything else here? Yeah, big defense. Oh, we're so close to getting just a little bit more naval XP. A little bit more, man. A little bit more. Where are we at? Oh, God. That one for now. I'll probably get rid of this one when we're done. This engine development's gone. It's fine. Uh, what's something cheap here? Look at all this stuff. We're not going to make tanks. I apologize that we're not making them. More railway guns? Yes, yeah, might as well. It's fine. Good. Oh, come on, please, 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 please. You guys got this. Can we throw one, two, like here? Invade, like, right there? Oh, I can still be there, huh? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, overall, not bad. Hmm. Yeah, come back to Europe, I guess. Old enemy. Yeah, that's true. We do have those guys to fight, too. Good old, old enemy. And go right there, too, maybe. See what you can do. You all kind of hanging out, having a good old time. Now I guess you can hang out here. After the old enemy, uh, the rifle air of the Empire will definitely deal with next. Now by the Pacific is actually not bad, either. Look, okay, we're slowly maybe winning here. Uh, the divisions aren't up here yet. They're, they're trying, though. They're, they're definitely trying. Oh my god, this is taking so long to do. What is wrong with this? Exile of veteran combat bonuses against three of the three enemy divisions. Fighting against enemies who occupy their core territory. Not Belgians, huh? Well. Time moving a little closer, I guess. Oh, that's even better. Hell yes, please. Um, where are we at? Oh, we actually won. Yay! Thank God. You guys just auto deploy to here, Riga. Nice. Good. I want to come right here. There you go. Good luck. Good luckerinos. What's up next? This one? Why not? Plenty of uh, peepee, though. 
Race for the bomb, yes please. Your integration. Fuel, all the sort of good stuff. Chromium, why not? Because we can. Literally just because we can. Alright, so with this group uh, taking over, that's actually extremely good for us. Yay, Newfoundland. Get another port here. Grab some radar because we're going to need it. Some expansion here. Get a couple air bases. Because we're going to launch all sorts of invasions down here too. Mongolia. We're already at war with them, so... Nothing like Russian cavalry going to be storming the beaches of America and and uh, Canada. All right, I don't think we have time to make these, but I'm gonna do this anyways. Cool. So, because of all these things we've made, um, we're gonna invade probably from. Hmm, I'd like to invade up here, but can we actually get naval supremacy here too? Maybe it's not that far away. We'll go to here, Halifax. One, two, three. Clouds look bad now, but they can always get worse. Two, three. And we're just going to be building up a lot of supply through here. Help them out there. Okay, right there. Oh, they're in the marsh. Oh, no wonder the supply is really bad. It's a marsh. Look at that combo. It's nice. Which means we probably stop doing this stuff as much. You guys go over to here. See what you can do. It'd be really good if you could do all that stuff as well. Okay, more railway guns? Okay, sure, why not? More fuel? That's fine. Are we ready to go? We need more, a little bit more naval supremacy. That's kind of stuff, that's okay. We can get it. We can get it. I promise we can get it. Wait, why is it not... What the heck? There you go. And naval bombers. So quite a few naval bombers we got here. There you go. When we can, we will. In the numbers of 1905, that's one first. Third Rome. With the Rome's protected, the holy place is secure. We are indisputable defenders of the faith. It's only bad that we should style ourselves accordingly. After the fall of Constantinople, Moscow has become, without a doubt, the third Rome. More organization, weekly stability, war support, more attack, and daily support for the underline. Nice. Stability? So no longer be available as advisor, but we get the same guy. Metropolitan Militius. Oh. Becomes leader for the non-aligned party. <clears throat> well, okay. Actually, how much supremacy do we have here? Can we do naval invasion support? Will that help out at all? No, it actually got worse. Well, keeps sinking right here. And you guys can do this as well. You got the crap bombed out of you. Oh, you're repairing Greenland? Oh, that's not good. That's taking so long to do, though. God dang it. I just want a naval invade, man. What's wrong with y'all? Grease it. And we need more fighters, that's fine. Duplicate some more. There you go. That's a little better. That's a little better. Please go in, please go in. For the love of God, please go in. Because if not, we have to invade up there too. Which is going to be god awful. And I don't want to do that. I do not. I hate invading America so much. It's so bad. Yeah, go up there. Might as well leave. See what you can do. Yeah, you guys can move here too. Well, that's a little better. Ooh, some destroyers have been sunk. That's good. Lost a couple planes. That's fine, whatever. Here we got the carriers over here. Philippines are gone. That's good. Come on. You should be able to invade now. That's so stupid. Here. Do invasion support. There we go. Hurry.
are they sinking us? Do we not have air superiority here? We should have pretty good air. Yeah, they definitely have their ships here. Go in. Uh, take take everything you can. Come on, go. God dang it. Go up here. Should be able to win. Advanced landing craft is good. Nice. Good, good, good. We got him. Okay, thank God. And you guys do this too. And I want to send you guys where he goes at. Oh, yeah, we're still going to pay these guys, don't we? Crap. Hey! We're with some. Good. It's fine, whatever. No one cares. How many torpedoes? Good! That's got more subs, so be it, so be it. Nice job up here as well. You guys should be fine. A few more railway guns makes us all happy, even though we're literally not even using them yet. You guys got what up here? Anything? No? Okay. Just go in. Just go in. Let's see what we can do. Rifle 8 of the Empire. Third Rome. Yay! 8? Okay, well, I'll just go right there then. But I lied. And then I lied again. We're expanding okay ish. You guys moving in? Very nice. Any more? Yes. We'll send all the infantry over there eventually. Here we get pushing, 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 pushing. We need plenty of radar around here. It's gonna need plenty of planes as well. Basically, heavy tank chassis. Well, we'll get them done by the end of the campaign, I suppose. Mines. I just want to do it just so we can get rid of some of these. Game, what would you do with that game? Never mind, that's what we want to do. Going through here, guys. Do it this way. Because the horses are going up there, anyways. Because this is literally all just a distraction here. If we lose all the horses, that really sucks, but whatever. It's all just a distraction here. Because this is really where we want to expand. Because now we're almost in America. Wow. I should not click on that so fast. We actually got a lot of good stuff, things done there. Oh well. Nice. Hey, we're almost there. Almost in America. New Brunswick. Get more planes. Fighting America is going to suck, but we can do it. I know we can. Hey, did you actually expand? Nice job, guys. Oh, do we prepare a collaboration government, too? Or just rescue the person? Oh, we did. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Oh, Sweden's gone, too. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. California now? Head on over here. It's not going to be very good, but head on over. Looking okay for now. Fighting and trying to fight into America is pretty bad. But with having cavalry up here, that's not bad. They move hopefully more quickly than anyone else. Two and a half is not great, but still better than what it could be. After third realm, then what? Memories of 1905? Uh, the war of 1905 is a black market of people's collective memory. We must exploit this and extort the workers, or extort the workers in a monumental effort to create a new fleet, which we made dominate the Pacific. And uh, to create a... Uh, a new fleet to dominate and fan the flames of their hatred so that we'll call for its use to extract our vengeance against our old enemies. Yeah. Do that too. You got it. You might as well use it. A little better. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, what do y'all have here? Anything? No? Horses. We're using a horse quite a bit in this episode, which I do like. Anti air? Yeah. You're gonna need, you definitely gonna need anti air here. Well, when you get there, so. 
Hey, we're in America. Welcome to New England. Welcome to Maine. Awesome. Yeah, actually, seeing the horse up here was a very, very good decision. I'm glad we did this one, guys. I'm glad we actually used the horses up here. Firefighting drills? Well, useful. Very useful. All this stuff? No, thank you. Proof lot battery. I don't really know that too much anymore. Better artillery, though, would be very good. So. Oh, I'm not going to capitulate Australia. I'm sorry. No. Absolutely not. Unless the Japanese do it immediately and intensely. Nah. I'm not going to beat him. But we will take out America. That's our goal, I guess, for this campaign. The way majors become. People become majors, and there's no peace out option, is a major. Uh, I don't say stain, but it's really, really just not good for uh, boy for in general. But the coronation of Patriarch Meletius. As the importance of religion is increasingly felt throughout our nation, and the status of the church is once again intended, nay, maybe exceeded what it once was, it's only natural that we solidify our commitment to God by the elevation of his foremost representative to the position of national leader. Huh. Today, in grand dual ceremonies in Savior Cathedral and Cathedral of the Dormition in Moscow, Meletius of Albin and Manchuria, elected in honor of his service to the exiled cause, was both enthroned as the Patriarch of Moscow and all Russia, or as well as, well as crowned Tsar of all Russias. With this final ultimate unification church and state, there's no obstacle remaining for the execution of the will of God on this early uh, theater. Fiat voluntas tua sicut in celo et in terra. Oh, so we actually become non-aligned. Whoops, I should have read that a little bit more easily. Uh, I'm going to stay fascist. I don't know we'd actually become this guy. Defy or the sun god. This is very weird. But I apologize if we if you want to be... Well, I want to stay fascist, though. I guess it would have made more sense to do pan Slavic nationalism. But at the same time, I did that one last time when I played as a Romanov Reconstruction, so I apologize for that. And that wouldn't make any sense for us to do anyways. We're already allied with the Germans and the Hungarians, even though getting rid of fascism here, I mean, doesn't make a ton of sense, but my apologies for that. Um, hmm. I mean, there would have really been no point, point to do this. Poland's already dead. So I apologize. That it's just, I know it says fascist, thumb, fascist, fascist Russia on the thumbnail, but it is what it is. I would have liked to get, would have liked to get Rozhevsky, but whatever. The Galsing? Oh yeah, supplies are really bad around here, aren't they? Fascist March on Cheetah. Having been refused a referendum, almost took an attempt to seize power legally. Fascists views a significant public support connection to the Russian military attempt to coup. The non aligned governments refuse their terms and clans going to fight to the end of preserve the roads, we know it. Stop at any cost. Oh, I'm not doing this. Okay, so we're not going to do this. Um, yeah, I apologize for this, but we're not going to be doing this part at all. Alright, everyone, so it's July 5th now, 1946, and I figured just capitulate America. Just get it over with. Uh, we've taken a lot of casualties, but I'm like, eh, just keep pushing. I've done a few more focuses off-screen. We've actually taken a lot of casualties against America. I hate killing off America. It's one of the worst things in Hoi Poor ever to do, especially late game. But they're dead, and we still got to kill Canada. We still got to kill off uh, Mexico, but I have a feeling they're not going to be too bad. Yeah, we lost a lot of divisions. I just I just got tired of it. I mean, by this point in the campaign, I'm just like, I'm kind of done. I'm kind of mentally checking out. But if you like to read these folks, this is like Emerging Naval Plants, which I've read before, as well as Ministry of the Russian Navy, um, Ministry of Mortar Armament, which is good for more breakthrough and defense. Artillery defense, I should say. Development of Tinko good as well. I think that's pretty much all we did. Also, regarding the whole, like, Civil War thing, I decided to do, like, do the referendum decision down here. I forget. Somewhere down around here. Just do the referendum. So, you know what? We're, we're still, uh, we're still Rozhevsky here, so we still have Rozhevsky. Papa Rozhevsky, why are we still losing stuff? Oh, it's because of the, the focus, right? So, Defense Industry Academy, or is it? It's because of it. Why do I keep losing it? So, at least he's back. No, we're still, uh, basically fascist. Um, Legacy of, oh, that's Legacy of Rome, that's why. That's what it is. Oh, there's this guy. And then we have this guy, Daily Fascist Support, and then we have this guy, too. Oh, that's not bad. We could lower stability, I suppose. See, we diplomat, driver of the faithful. Uh, no more, no more fashion support though, which kind of does suck. But whatever. And we merge naval plants. After this one, we could do the Lonely Island, but there are our allies already. And Empire of the Pacific though is pretty good, so we'll do this one, the Lonely Island. On that, no, not also happening. We got um, modern tanks researched, but we're literally at the end of the campaign. So at this point, I'm thinking probably not. I don't know. Tanks just aren't worth it. They're just not worth it in my experience. And I know a lot of people say that too, but I don't know. It just feels like they just... They cost so much. Especially as a Russia, when you're trying to get everything done and reformed. 
but you just can't get anything done reformed as fast as you done as you want, especially after civil war. Also, Spain did go to war with a whole host of other nations, so Chile and Colombia like that. Also, I did use cost commands. I'll be honest, I did use cost commands and had the Japanese annex Australia because I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna deal with this. This is just not fun. I do not want to deal with this at all. So. Yeah, we're not doing all Australia, and hopefully these guys capitulate soon. We'll see what happens. Come on, guys, keep going. Canada's dead, which is good. Keep, 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 keep going. And there you go. But yeah, I hate using comms commands, but sometimes it just at this point in the campaign, I'm, I'm done. I'm mentally checked out already. So yeah, it's not bad. It's just by the time you reform like any sort of Russia that's not fascist or not communist, I mean, it's just. It's kind of like a chore. You know, by the time we get here. Oh, she wasn't. Oh, we need way more artillery. Holy crap. Yeah. I'm going to go down 15 for now. There you go. But yeah. I don't know. I just wish Russia wasn't that weak. But at least we allied with the Germans for this campaign, which is kind of nice. I don't think I've ever done that one before. Maybe I have. Maybe I haven't. I can't remember. But yeah. Mexico City, please just die. Please just. Just. Just die. My supplies probably aren't too good down here either, so. Just in case, and then boing bong boom. Eh, just in case, you could probably use it. We'll get them eventually. How's America so fighting us? Ooh, do we have any upgrades? I mean, we're out. You know what? Why not? We'll, ch we'll let you do that one. Also, I did choose. What is this? Well planned. A preferred tactic is well planned attack for everybody here. We have logistical focuses now. We've got a proper heritage. We've got a bold attack. We've got no spirit of the academy. Naval academy. Uh, someone falls ill. What a time to fall ill. Yeah, this will be okay. This over here, independent air force. Advisor cost not really worth it. Independent spirit. Uh, air accidents chance goes down. Material destruction. Yeah, research speed doesn't really help us out that much right now, anyways. Hey, we won. Now we'll do some mass strikes. Okay, so there we go. We've won the war. It was very annoying to do, but whatever. Um, uh, German doesn't deserve anything. We'll get Sweden. We'll get uh, stuff like that. Well, German deserves a little bit of stuff. Polish Republic. Oh god, this is so ugly. Uh, maybe we won't take Rakal. Yeah, let's leave it like that. Germany, you can have this stuff. You can have that stuff, you can have this stuff, you can have the Swiss babies. Uh, but yeah, I didn't think it, we'd actually get it done in this episode, but yeah, we did. Not bad. Denmark, Norway. There you go, Germany. There you go. Mm, Dutch people. And you can have Ireland. Let's go. Japan, you can have Korea. Philippines. And the Dutch East Indies. Wait, where'd it go? What? Come on. We had it open. Well, we'll take Mexico. America. Very nice. Spain will get some of this stuff too. Uh, these guys. Mongolia. Canada. Germany will get Belgium. You guys will get a lot of people here. Oh. Spain did like nothing down here, but they get Colombia. They'll get Chile. I think that's going to be very nice to them. What the heck is this? Oh, and Pierce, New Zealand, or whatever. And we'll take Bremen, Iceland. There we go. Not bad. Now the war is over. And I think the campaign for this part is pretty much mostly done. Not a bad route. Kind of difficult. But I just got to make sure. What the heck? Right. What? Great Zimbabwe? Wait! You s Are you sure that would be right? Great Zimbabwe? Votraka Monument? Um... Uh, if anything, I'd rather you be called Rhodesia? Uh, that doesn't make any sense. Actually, I need to play South Africa sometime. I've never played them. And I guess France did release some colonies. Kinda sucks. But their Rome doesn't look too bad. I wish we did have, uh... Actually, I guess we do have Rome. And Istanbul, Constantinople with us. But yeah, I think that's going to be it for us. Uh, Germany... Did, oh, crap. I forgot to give that to Germany. Whatever. That's ours now. We do have London, so... Overall, I think the Axis has done really well in this, this timeline. Literally every single state, except for Liberia, is in... Af uh, in, the Af blah, 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 in these continents. Well, you know what I mean. All about Liberia. And South America's looking pretty good, too. We already have the Confederate South American nations. But I think that's going to be it for us here. If you enjoy the campaign, leave a fat like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I guess I'll catch you all tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great, great Axis rest of your day.